What's up, and welcome back to Storytime with AJ. I'm your host, AJ. In this week's episode, I'll tell you about the time my mom beat up some kids for me. Pretty hilarious. Without any further ado, let's jump into it. So it's eighth grade graduation. Uh, it, where I went to school, it was K through six, kindergarten through sixth grade, and then they had junior high, which is seventh, eighth grade, and then you graduated from that and moved on to high school, ninth through twelfth. So at the end of eighth grade, they have a graduation. Like, it's some kind of celebration that you get to go to high school, follow the law, like you have to complete 12th grade. I don't know. Anyway, I'm at 8th grade graduation, and I'm standing next to a a buddy of mine, Spencer. And he's a pretty cool guy, um, but... He comes up to me and says, hey, can you, after graduation, can you walk with me to the parking lot? There's these kids that want to kick my ass. So I reassure him. I'm like, sure, I'll walk with you. But, I mean, in 8th grade graduation, there's all kinds of parents, security guards. Nobody's going to pick a fight with you here. Don't worry about it. But I'll walk with you. So ceremony ends, and me and Spencer walk down. And sure enough, these two kids that want to fight him come up to him and start talking shit. What I didn't know is these two kids were like 17 years old, close to six foot tall both. I'm about, I'm pushing five eight at this point in eighth grade. Um, but like, they're obviously bigger and they want to pick a fight. So I try to intervene, get in between them and say, hey, you know, like if you guys want to fight, do it somewhere else. Like there's all kinds of security guards, parents. This is like the most inopportune time to throw down. At which point the biggest kid pushes me super hard from the side, like just launches me not in the air on my ass, but like to the side about a good two, three feet. And I turn around super pissed at this point, right? Like, all right, I tried to be nice and shit, but now I'm going to blast somebody in the face. Like, so my hands are balled up. I'm looking at this guy and I'm telling, and I'm about to be like, what the fuck? When all of a sudden in the field of my view, This old woman comes in and basically like jumps up off the ground to slap him. Smacks this dude super hard in the face. And the kid's face is like one of bewilderment. He wasn't expecting to get bitch slapped by some old lady. So at this point I'm like, who the fuck is this old lady? And why is she jumping in on my fight here? So I'm about to like chew this old lady out. Like, hey, listen, old lady, thanks and everything, but I got this. When I hear my mother's voice. And it dawns on me that this old woman that jumped up and slapped this poor kid in the face is my fucking mom. And she's apologizing profusely. Quick side note here. My mom runs like a children's party business in town. So her motherly instinct kicked in and she slapped this kid because she saw him, she saw this kid push her son. But now she, all she can think about as she's apologizing is the newspaper headlines. You know, local party woman slaps kids in face, assaults children. So, of course, I'm like in eighth grade and I'm fucking mortified. I mean, I can laugh about it now. I think it's hilarious. But at the time, I'm like super embarrassed. And all my mom can do is apologize to me. And all I can say to her is like, listen, I fought before. I can fight my own battles. You know, even if I get my ass kicked, at least I get my ass kicked. The worst is you jump in and all my friends see you beat up some kid for me. Luckily, though, this was in between, you know, the end of school and the beginning of high school junior high and high school so i did it did have three months to blow over and i never heard anything about it again but it was pretty funny and thank god no assault charges or anything like that i got levied against my mom anyway hope you guys enjoyed the super short sweet uh story i'll be back soon with another one uh drop gta man a like and a follow and i'll see you guys later peace